What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. He did. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. You can rewind time, girl. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. Oh, man. can you give me an example of a man, photographer? I cannot believe who this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Mueller. Diane. Can I actually reverse time? Why are right, mouse button to rewind. Because of her images of hopeless so, faces. This is going to have like a totally little bit of weird overlap them. because I'm not able to record everything at the same I time. I should rewind. Yes, we will right now. Okay. It's like we have just a little like predetermined timer length for re rewinds. Oh, and our camera is it? Ah, yeah. I did it. Can you give I me actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured I'm a the human, human time machine. And Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't yeah, freak out. Yeah. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? So we still because have all the same options. So we probably should like totally take a haunted selfie. By the eyes of those sad mothers and when I took my selfie, Jefferson She's asked me a question. Tortured. Yeah, let's do it. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Well, let's do it. Seriously though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner <laughs> and capture you in a moment of death. Shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits? Well, it's the Daguerrean effect, but I don't think we are able to do it, so let's just say I have to use the bathroom. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're oh, not gonna on. get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me he after class. And I need time to save that girl. Types. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective okay, so style. She like just a answered it. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. Right. What if I rewind the again and give him the right answer? Let's do that. People's faces. Is it making a... them extremely popular from the eighteen hundreds onward. The first American daguerreotype. Yeah, okay. Sorry. Thought it was Chef for some reason. Um. Shift to rewind faster, okay. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits? Go the Daguerrean process. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. Yeah, we're basically <laughs> awesome. The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. Cool. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max so. is so far way ahead yep. of that. Class is over. And guys, don't forget the, the deadline to girl. submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. Let's do it. Are our conversations with Kate the same? I'm just curious. I know we're in a hurry, but... Nice answer, Max. Are you okay? You look pale. Kate, um... Did we talk at all today? This is the first time. What's wrong? I'm sorry, I'm just tripping. Too much yeah, stress. seriously. I know the feeling. Um... I wish we didn't, I guess. 
This girl seems cool. I wish we didn't. I do have to go, but we can talk later if you want. I'll see how I feel. Thanks, Max. Aw, she feels better now. That's good. Alright, nothing else that we can interact with. I don't assume, like, this paper ball would have changed, right? What are you waiting for? Go! Yeah. <laughs> they won't even let me. Alright, let's... Uh, actually, can we just leave without having to talk to him? I know the answer, but you I guys see you, don't. Max Caulfield. Yep. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Alright, what's up, dude? I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Um, I'm not sure if I have one. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about <laughs> a thousand pics by now. Yep. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Okay. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Uh, so we can rewind that, right? Up until probably that dot in the corner. Yep, there we go. Oh no, speak. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Um, let's, yeah, use the John Lennon I'm on top of said. it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. No I problem. Have faith in you. Uh, Mr. Jefferson. Alright, let's, uh, let's get out of here and let's go to the bathroom. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, Please. Hold shift to move faster. I can't faster. tell anybody. Okay, cool. They'll think I'm crazy. We're just gonna run through here and see what we can yeah, do. You know I don't I hate that science class with those nerves. All right. Let's do okay, it. Max. Retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly. Butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! Okay, you know what can we do? I am, or who you're messing around with! Where did you get that? Oh, fire extinguisher. What are you doing? Come Don't on, put that ever. thing down! Tell me what to do. Wow, so I need a hammer to break it open. Okay. They control me. Uh, oh, we can look at. Oh, nope. hella more Move. trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would. There's the hammer. Never even missed your punk ass, would they? Take. Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. Holy shit! I can't let this happen. So can if we? If I reverse time again, I can help her. So we keep our facts and inventory. More trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even hammer. miss your punk ass, would they? <laughs> No way! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Yeah, seriously. Is he gonna Have find a her shitty photo? Day. No, okay. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. That's a cool shot. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. <laughs> excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The that situation is under control. <laughs> There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Sick this, bro. Alright, let's talk to this guy. I think he's like a. I would assume he's our president, right? Oh, principal, that's it, yeah. Principal Wells always looks so distracted. I can never figure out what he's thinking. Okay. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my 
future. Aren't we You're all? sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Um, I think the right thing to do would be to report Nathan. Let's try it. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind uh, the stall. He's not going to believe us. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. Yeah, of course and he is. And one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? I think then, he's... Then yeah, he left. He's going to try to pin I it on I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Yeah. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. That was a bad idea. We should rewind. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Yeah, we should definitely change it. How can I control? There we go. Uh, and then speak. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? We'll skip that. Um, we're gonna hide the truth. Because he can't I handle the truth. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. <laughs> I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that team too again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Please. Sure, Mr. Boss Man. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Left mouse button yes, to go to main could campus. Rewind actual... I don't want to tell him the truth, so... Nice. The graphics of this game are really, like, weirdly interesting. I like them a lot, even though they're not, like, super well-defined. It's still, like, beautiful in, in some aesthetic. Um, okay. Let's see what's going on. Uh, that's still that Rachel Amber girl. Miss Grant. Can I talk to you? Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition. But would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Talks about herself in the third person. Let's do it. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. I don't know, that's a tough, that's a tough, uh... Yeah, I could go with that's crazy or it could have helped Rachel. Uh, this is the security guy that gave us crap. Um, let's see what this option does. I guess cameras could have helped Rachel. I can see both sides. You're fair-minded, Max. And we all pray Rachel is found safe and sound, bless her soul. But this petition isn't about her. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Uh, I mean, I'm not too interested in seeing all the options of this you lady. You know a lot about Blackwell for being a science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. <laughs> There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Yeah? Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Ah, uh, I don't know how I feel about it. 
I wonder what kind of implications this can have. I mean, this whole thing wouldn't have happened if there were cameras, right? Or people monitoring the cameras. Let's sign it. Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Hmm. Yeah, it will. All right, we'll see. See how badly it affects everything. Do the Bigfoot? Let's look at that poster. Look. I would so be there if a Sasquatch actually did battle a Razorback. <laughs> yeah, that'd actually be really awesome. All right, back. Let's see what else is going on. So this is a new person we haven't seen before. Hey, Hayden. There she is! The retro selfie master. That's me, all right. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents oh, the Vortex Oh, he's part Club. of the Vortex Club. Not to boast. Oh, yeah, of course. Um, let's not... I mean, let's ask him about Nathan, I guess. I hope it doesn't... We can always rewind. Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's alright and a fun guy to hang with. Yeah, Fuck you think haters. so? Alright. I'll just give it to you, fair enough. Fair enough, but I'm still not going to party with him. Your loss, bro, is fucking hilarious when he's blazed. And he does always have the best shit. Yeah, of course he does. Um, let's just talk later. Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> okay, Brooke. Let's talk to her. She seems pretty cool. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Um... Sure. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? <laughs> uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Hey. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Wow, don't be rude. Let's see. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. The Highfly Evo. B400. Can we rewind? And then speak to her again? Sorry, Max. I have to focus on making sure this drone doesn't crash. Okay, well, we didn't rewind long enough. Do I have to- I have to keep going back until it, it should stop me, I think. Let's see. There we go. Yeah, it stops me. Speak. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? You want me to fly your drone? That looks like a high fly drone. Model B400 EVO. Now that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that. Uh... Especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. Here. Give the drone a whirl around campus. Oh, do we actually get to do this? Am I gonna like crap? Oh yeah. Oh, okay. I accidentally skipped it, but that's pretty cool. So we're making friends. Uh, one from Warren. Tab to open journal. like cl classic text text messaging jesus um all right let's scroll up this guy's super needy do you want to meet for coffee after school i need an excuse to not study please make sure to check out the neck romantic on your my flash drive max let's bust it up oh, i have to study for a physics test don't ignore this message flash drive i need some help hello sorry running late it's been a crazy day and most certainly it has I'll meet you in the lot, looking cool. You'll see. My camera will be ready. Okay, cool. And can we just escape out of this? Dad. 
You're an adult now, but you're still our little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Oh, thanks, Dad. Nice. Kate. Do you want to get tea later? Absolutely. I'll be free at four. Awesome. Cool. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Uh, that's, we already talked to that guy. Press tab to open your journal. I think we already did that. Alright, let's talk to Stella, because she's in our class. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? Um, yeah, I think he is. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. <laughs> Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. Oh. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Uh, now that you mention it, uh, sure. Now that you mention it, he doesn't respond to Victoria's flirting. That means he has good taste. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Oh, really? Well, I heard that from a good source. You knew Rachel? So, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. So she was part of the... the preppy girls. Alright. Can I take a photo here? This is a great image. All those rippling green coins. I hope everybody got their wish. But I can't take a photo, huh? Okay. Oh, we can sit down. That's all right. What's over there? Swimming pool in the parking lot. So we can't. We shouldn't go over there yet because we need to uh, pick up the flash drive from our dorm. Who's this guy? Justin. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash. Uh, Thrash. Thrash? You mean stage diving or? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple no slide or a tray flip. You should walk on. Oh man. Alright, let's uh let's rewind that. Let's talk to him again. Yo, Justin. Check out the max. Come to Thrash? Well, I came to no slide. I came to no slide. <laughs> but I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh sick. You're not a poser. Nah. I just can't skate worth shit. Yeah, that's the oh, truth. Check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you wanna see? I want to see a tray. Go for a tree flip. Oh. Let's get Trevor all over that action. Okay, cool. Let's see this tray. Oh, ow. Oh, he hit himself in the nuts. Let's go talk to him. I'll take a photo. <laughs> That's so bad. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Tab to go to journal. Oh, sick, here's our photos. Are these all the ones that we can take? Huh, these must be all the ones that we can take. Interesting. Uh, Alright. Let's get going to our dorms. Huh, there must be, there's so much to this. Like, I don't know if I should try to get everything, right? Can we take a photo of the squirrel? No, we can't. Okay. All right, let's just uh exhibition panel. Mr. Jefferson has such a gift for different styles. Uh yeah, I guess that's some pretty cool stuff. Where we go? Main building, dormitories, yeah, this way. Let's talk to this guy. Luke. I don't think that's somebody we've seen before. Clever. Yeah, Vortex Club sucks. Speak. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. Um, uh, what's wrong? What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. Yeah, he is. Somebody needs to take that prick down. 
Um, he'll take himself down. He'll take himself down. Yeah, history always proves that, right? Just wait for justice, you sheeple. Oh man. Sorry, dude. Alright, let's talk to this guy and then move to the dormitories. Okay, this is the guy who has good photo stuff. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who For photographed the famous fallen, fallen soldier? So I know this just because, but... Uh, Robert Kappa. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's Pretentious why much? <laughs> You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? A perusal? It's not a privilege I grant to many. Yeah, let's I'd do it, I'd be honored, dude. sir. Uh, let's look at this thing. And how crappy it is. Ah, uh, yeah, it's pretty bad. <laughs> Alright, and it looked like he knew Rachel, so... Hi, Evan. As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite model here. She knew exactly what yeah. angles worked best with my eye. Interesting. Um, you were close? You were close. Like brother and sister in arms. She understood me, never judged me. I hated her vortex club click, but she never acted like she cared. Interesting. Her friends were her friends. What do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. Alright, let's get going to the dorms. 